we had high hopes of getting out of the league, but through a combination of injuries and you know fellas not available this year, we got off to a bad start and we lost a lot of narrow games. But having said that, we finished strong. We had a great win against London away from home. So um, we finished strong, but disappointed then that we didn't get to play Leitrim, obviously, and to try and get up the table. So a lot of some good points, some bad points. We saw new players, um, tried out a lot of new players in the champ in the league, and they performed very well. And that augurs well for Watford football that there's new players coming on stream every year. Tipperary, I suppose, have been, I suppose, the team have come from nowhere over the last number of years, and especially under Liam Kearns, they really have blossomed. 2016, we played them in the first round as well, and they beat us by seven points below in Dungarvan, and they went on to the other in the semi-final that year. And last year, obviously, they were unlucky against Cork, lost by a point. We would hope that we could perform like we did last year, but it's going to be very hard, as I said, because I think Tipperary will have a good run again this year. I suppose we surprised a lot of people our performance against Cork. Um, you know, probably should have got a victory against Cork last year, but ultimately we didn't. So I suppose what I'm looking for at Waterford this year is the same as 2017, and obviously a bit better. Um, no, we're down a good few players from last year, through one reason or another. And it's going to be very difficult. But I think Warford will perform with the usual spirit that they bring to every championship game.